today I'm doing this video because I want to talk about spark plugs different types of spark plugs different heat ranges and how they can affect the performance running performance of your engine uh, especially after you first initially rebuild your engine you are going to experience different results uh, different running performance levels after you install a brand new set of piston rings if you're re-ringing your engine just honing and re-ringing not reboring, putting new pistons in but reusing pistons and just putting new rings on or whether you're reboring new pistons, new rings everything now of course you're going to get a better experience if you do a complete rebore and a new fitment of new pistons and new rings but today in general we're just going to be discussing reusing pistons, rehoning the cylinders and re-ringing it so what you can expect after re-ringing your engine is you're going to get and reusing the pistons you're going to probably experience <clears throat> a loss of, little loss of compression um, especially if you are reusing pistons and your cylinders are worn out a little bit uh, in, in my case I had worn out cylinders they were slightly worn and I uh, installed uh, some oversized pistons they were about 0 .020 over from my other engine to tighten the clearance the piston to wall clearance which worked pretty well and I, I was satisfied with the fitment and after the initial startup I experienced a loss of compression because the rings weren't seated yet and they weren't sealing the combustion chamber gases so the gases were escaping past the rings into the crankcase and in that case uh, my oil was getting dirtied up pretty fast like within just a couple days two three days of running it the oil would become discolored darkened and at that time uh, there was a little sediment left over from the rebuild I didn't get it all out so you know that didn't help either but so these plugs right here this is what the plugs look like after I started the engine for the first time and ran it they were black oily and slightly fouling uh, the engine was uh, misfiring slightly as you can see they're all blackened slightly oil with gas so it was very difficult to tune the engine set the timing and tune the carburetor when I was losing compression and this is what you'll experience so um, don't get discouraged if you yourself experience a rough running motor after the initial startup because it's most likely the rings haven't seated yet and the cylinders some some engines it takes thousands of miles of driving before the rings uh, completely seal up um, 
other engines these they seal up right away uh, I've had diesel engines uh, after I rebuilt a couple of Suzu 4 of B1 motors they would see and seal up right away and those were cast iron rings uh, fully bored with uh, new pistons new rings and it just ran great right after the initial startup now as time went by oh and by the way these are the uh, NGK VPR 6ES 11s and those are a slightly higher heat range and I used these when I noticed I was getting oil deposits on the plugs I was trying to prevent misfiring during the initial running stages after the rebuild so I went to a higher heat range plug and that was the result now over time what, what I did was I started using my number three was fouling the most the number three plug so the rest of them were coming getting cleaner as time went by so in the number three which was still fouling I purchased this E346 E plug and it has three prongs on it and this actually worked and kept the plug the end of it the tip the very tip of the electrode clean it was burning off the oil deposit right on the end and so I kept running this for a while and I kept using the same um, NGK plugs and through about after about a thousand miles of driving the ring started sealing up and it started looking like this nice dry gray ash which is normal this one was still the number three was still fallen now recently recently um, I went to Iridium's Iridium XP like this one and you can see the tip it's like a needle point tip and these actually work pretty good higher heat range of course also so I ran these for a long time probably about eight months and uh, I noticed that I was getting kind of a uh, slight uh, double miss once in a while on one cylinder or two cylinders while driving it and I came to the conclusion that it's possible that the higher heat range plug was <coughs> causing the cylinder to run hotter than normal and it was causing uh, pre-detonation in the cylinder which caused a misfire so I ended up taking the E3 plug out and just running straight four iridiums in it and I noticed recently a couple weeks ago that the number three plug stopped burning I stopped burning oil and fell in my number three plug meaning that the rings the rings finally sealed up on the number three cylinder now all four cylinders 
look like this. So what I've done recently is I pulled these out. I pulled these plugs out and I, I just put a brand new set of standard AC Delco 63 plugs in. And I'm going to run those for about a month and drive it around. And I'm going to pull them out and I'm going to check to see if the number 3 is still coming out clean. And if it is coming out clean, that definitely means that the ring's finally sealed up on the number 3 cylinder. And so I'm pretty happy with the results. And I just kind of wanted to touch on uh, those points that you can experience a rough running engine when you're losing compression from a fresh set of rings that haven't sealed yet and it will be difficult to tune it set the ignition timing I mean it can it can run rough after you know tightening up the ignition timing and then getting it close to your uh, six degree below top dead center mark until these rings seal up you know you know you're just gonna have to wait and run it run it the way it's run and there's nothing you can do about it just keep running it and driving it and uh, hopefully eventually you know all the rings will seal up but it took me a year about a year for my rings to completely seal and set and I changed sets of plugs after sets of plugs probably I went through about four sets to get it right and I used an e-plug on the number three that was using the most oil I ran that for two months, three months, and then I it was starting to burn cleaner, so I eventually just ran all four of the same type of plug, the, the 11s, BPR 6 E11. And I ran that for about six months, and now I'm running standard AC Delco 63s in it. And uh, that's kind of all I wanted to discuss today. So I hope you guys have a great day. I'm out.